Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Hearthstone 4, Modern Day and German Reich and Axis Strikes Back. So we have expanded quite, well I was gonna say quite a bit, but no we haven't. We have only expanded and taken Austria. We're going to keep expanding right now by taking Slovenia and then hopefully Croatia too. We'll exactly see how much we can take before people start just uh, guaranteeing people. Apparently it's supposed to be 40% well tension before people start guaranteeing. So we have a bit more room to, well, play around. Uh, let's see. Italy, you should definitely turn at the next election, 2006. And Japan, you should turn... Yeah, you should also turn at the next election, election 2006. Is, do you have the same date? No, April and June. Or July. Was it July or June? <laughs> July. Alright, cool. So, both of them are going to turn fascist and we're going to be safe from there. So, after that, when both of them are in the Axis, we can begin our world war. But until that moment, we're just going to build up Germany and make them as strong as possible. Cool. Um, I had completely forgotten about that the whole election mechanic and they're going to turn that way. So, that's pretty cool. So, um... Let's see, how's it going right now? We're doing quite fine. Equipment wise, artillery wise. Artillery wise. That's the only thing we're missing right now. 111 artillery and 11 attack aircraft, but we don't really care that much about it. We have our, well, minus 1500 tanks, but that's something else. That's because, oh, well, is it? actually mostly from yeah from new deployments okay cool it's only from new deployments so we don't have to worry that much about it we are trying to fix that though quite soon let's see let's put one more line right here as soon as you're done we are missing oil and the chromium and oil we need to trade for more oil or are we building more no we're not even building more so we should definitely be building more i want to be as self-sufficient as possible Especially as Germany, since, well, eventually people stop trading with us. So we can't do anything. Uh, we should actually try not to build right there, when I think about it. Uh, this is much better, because we want to keep the coastline for naval factories. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to take it as priority. P pick that at highest priority and just build that synthetic refineries. We need it basically right now. Uh, chromium, that's something we can't really build. Actually, we could. That's five, chromium. Hmm. Sure. Let's build uh, some chromium too. Uh, let's even put it lowered. Let's fix both of that first before all our military factories. So even after like five hours now that I did my stream, I want more Hearts of Iron. And I'm going to do it and bring you one more, one episode at least. For all of you who did not watch the live stream I had. Let's see Naval bases, yeah, maybe. Uh, maybe. Hmm. Wasn't it something? Yeah. Bundeswehr shortcomings. Weren't you gonna like remove that, or is it you? Maybe it is that you are the one. You are moving it. Uh, let's at least do it now. W now that I know that um, it's 40% for world tension, for people to start guaranteeing people left and right, gaining nine, p nine more world tension, it's fine. It's fine. But I would like to avoid it. At least keep it down as much as possible until we have Italy and Japan on our side. Because once they start on our side, we can start, well, be a bit more aggressive. If the world war would accidentally start then, then it's kind of fine. Though, I, like I said, I still want to avoid it for as long as possible. Because um, as if you see right here, we're still missing some tank divisions that should be standing right here. Like against this border, this border, this border, this border, this border, and this border. That's kind of scary right now. So, uh, modified government. Can we continue it? We're gaining... Well, no, we're not gaining anything right there. So, yeah, we're gonna stay at moderate taxes, I think. Uh, political advisors... Uh, isn't one right here somewhere to build refineries faster? Or do we already have you? 
No, we don't, don't have it. Here, Captain Windows 2. Refine your construction speed plus 5%. Thank you. I will grab every single thing I can get. Because this is taking quite a while to build. Over 80 days each. So, yeah. If we can hurry that up by anything, please. So, how long more? Another 15 days before we take you. And that's going to be, well, a couple more factories. Not a lot, but a tiny bit. Everything counts. In the end, uh, let's see, unfulfilled important request. Oh, we don't get everything we want from you anymore. Hmm. Should we trade with someone else? No, let's just wait until all of these are done. Sure, we get one month for bad production. I think we'll be fine. Artillery upgrade, thank you. Let's maybe continue down. Let's get that better motorized instead. Mechanized, mechanized, not motorized. Mechanized, very big difference, very important difference. Armor, no armor. So, 140 factories. Looking better. Uh, cool, that's now done. If we declare the war, that should be fine. No one should really stand against us. Just go in, grab it. And there we go. Ah, <laughs> oh, delayed me. Thank you. Grab all of these states. And turn, and done. Thank you. So we now have a core state. Ooh, that's very good, very good. That means we're gonna get everything right here. And uh, does that include anything right here or maybe here? Calling state, no. Is there a couple areas right here? It would be nice with a map mode to tell exactly what's counted as my core state. I'm pretty sure they added some stuff right here, maybe. Uh, or maybe it was just this area. Hmm, might have been. I wonder why everyone would be mad at me then. I'm just adding a couple of core states. Not even in your territory. Why are you mad? Oh wait, here. Oh yeah. I knew it was something against Russia. That was why I was confused. Yeah, right here. We need to take back Ostprosen. Right here. Oh what? Yeah. So we have a couple of, we have one more new tank. Thank you. Welcome. So Croatia. That should still be fine, 29%. Let's go in for them. Gather up, um, no national focus yet, Lebensraum. No, 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 we're not going that far yet, we're not going that far yet. Let's see, industry, no. No, nothing right there. Let's see, without Britain, to all alliances, military reform. I guess I could always get, oh, here, here. Fix the Buddhist there. I knew it was something I missed. Emergency plan, not in a defensive war. Uh, one of following, okay, cool. Then we need to go, well, military reform, army focus, army program, and then that one. Cool, cool. That's that's the one that fixes this one. 25% recovery rate and organization. It's a huge penalty, like massive. That needs to be gone before any kind of major war begins. Uh, high stability, actually, what does it say? In a stork of bad shape, helicopter tanks, ship planes, there are logistic and economic challenges with all of them. We need to reduce the size of our military or devote serious resources to fix all of our problems. Then we're gonna devote, uh, devote uh, seven, 210 days for this to fix it. Uh, that's, well, I don't know how serious the problems can be if you can fix them within a year, but they are pretty bad. Let's see. Getting really power and gain. We have a couple of good people right here yes very nice we basically have a couple of well advice we need to pick it's kind of sad that these are not custom for everyone the, it's the generic ones for everyone and everyone is specialist nothing ha no one has anything special let's see uh, let's continue right here backhand blow thank you and let's see missing equipment artillery wait are we not producing any artillery and we want it in our ghost divisions? Yeah, we do. We don't... What? How can I miss this? Uh, you should probably... Then let's ignore ignore you. Artillery. We need at least... Uh, yeah, this will probably be enough. How many are there? Five, eight. Eight factories on artillery. Yeah, that would probably be enough. Uh, let's see, missing equipment production, attack aircraft, ca carrier capable. What, we have carriers? No, it's just, oh right, it's just something that needs to be reinforced, yeah. Then it's fine. I don't plan to have any. 
I basically want a big um, fighter air force, if anything. So yeah, we're producing fighters, so I'm happy with it. I'm just gonna use the ones I have right now. Cool. How many more days? Another 110 days, so we can be a bit more safe. Uh, April 2006 can't come quick enough. The same thing with you. Which, about even further away, you lie. 2006. I think the Second World War be will begin maybe 2007. Like the real big world war. Not the small, tiny, poking, see if anyone gets mad world wars. Well, it's not a world war. It's a. Well, it's a world war for the nation we're taking over. They're getting completely invaded and swallowed up by the German Empire. No, German Reich. German Reich. Or Reich. Depending on if you're gonna say it the German way or not. Ugh, only three factories right there. That's kind of sad. Only three um, oil that way, which is kind of sad. Maybe what? Maybe that was why I didn't want to build any. But still, three is better than nothing, and I will need it. I will definitely need it. Let's see. Otherwise, we're doing quite fine. We have. Let's see. We have. Uh, 10, 20, 25 chromium coming. And we will eventually go down to... Actually, we should definitely go down to limited exports. Yeah. Limited exports. Here I come. We're currently trading away way too much. With limited, we would almost be fine in most of the things. Closed economy, we would be fine. No? Maybe. Almost. We would almost be fine with closed economy. Like, super close. We could, we could just build up a couple more refineries. Refi a couple more... Yeah, refineries or factories, I guess. That's somewhere called. And just fix it completely. So, yeah. Let's let's try to get closed economy. And focus a bit more on actually building up our factories and our resources. Because soon enough, we will be isolated. Sure, we could trade a bit more with Japan, but... Most of the stuff would be intercepted. We could trade with Italy, but what does Italy have? Uh, they have nothing that would be of use. So yeah, we're really trying to fill our nation with everything we might need. Uh, no, no, don't pick anything, don't pick anything. It's laws you want. So let's hide that one even, so you don't accidentally pick anything. You want trade laws, nothing else for now. Sorry, Shadranka. God, I slaughtered that name. But sorry. Bye bye. I'm gonna take you over very, very soon. <laughs> You're not even getting one skill. You're taking over three nations right now. And you still haven't gone from skill one to skill two. <laughs> wow. Is it, uh, do you mean anything by it? <laughs> I think yeah, I think it might be. Not meeting any hard resistance. So let's see. Panzer lead is 6% done. So you're gonna get that rate. That's at least very, very good. Unassigned division. Oh, it's that. Oh, it's only one. Never mind. From uh, from exercise 0 0.004. Very, very little exercise. Let's see. Nothing more to pick. Oh, no. So, encryption, decryption. No, that's also something I don't want just yet. Uh, let's see. Nope. Night attack. Nope. Uh, modern. Yeah, could maybe pick something like that. Let's see, don't we have anything more useful? Logistics. Oh, right, artillery and anti-air anti -air gun and stuff like that. Yes, that we could definitely pick. Um, all right. You guys suggested that let's see if I can actually find who. Uh, let's jump into this episode, pause the game and listen to myself for half a second and double check the comments. Uh, hopefully you know the Berlin, Alli uh, Berlin Alliance is Axis 2.0. Yeah, if sure. If 56 people voted for it, so I won't call it Axis. I will just call it Berlin Alliance. Sure, sure. We will. I will. I accept that definitely. I don't really care. To be honest, <laughs> sorry, but yeah. If you want Berlin Alliance, then that's Berlin Alliance. You're gonna get. Uh, you should build some infantry division. Fill up the gaps until you have more tanks at your coast. Yeah, that's true. I should probably do that. That was one thing I wanted to find. Yeah, you could be a decent garrison division for a while at least. But we're missing artillery for that. 
Uh, let's just have six divisions being trained at all time. Artillery, you soon have your factories, but it goes very, very slowly right now. Uh, we have almost fixed our chromium problem and almost fixed our oil problem. All we have to do now is switch from export to limited. We're getting 11 factories though, so that's kind of nice. Hopefully we won't lose all of them, but I expect a loss of maybe 3-4 factories. Most, well, at least I should say. Not at most, at least. <laughs> Completely different things. So, Croatia. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Uh, oh, no, no, never mind. I just, I just, see, United States is trying to do something. They're trying to do something. <laughs> I tried to hold it, uh, <laughs> hold over the flag just to make sure that was the US and it disappeared before I had time to do it. So, they're trying to do something sneaky right there and I really hope it's not something like invite to NATO right now when I on pause. Oh, we're safe. Cool. <laughs> And there we go. Gone. Or? Is the nation gone? Yes? No? Maybe? Cool. There we go. Uh, Croatia. Annex everything. Done and done. 33%. Maybe we should just continue then. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, you were kind of bad nation. Uh, well, you were not a bad nation, but... Let's see, you didn't have very much, you don't. You have quite a lot, Yugoslavia. Well, you were kind of part of... Right, didn't you say stuff about that too? Here's the idea for modern day playthrough, nope. Annex, annex Slovak, uh, Slovenia, annex Austria, puppet Croatia and give them Bosnia. Whoops. Puppet Slovakia. Annex Chechnya. I could I could pop it. Let's see, can we fix this? Can we fix this? Manch occupied. Oh right. Aerodogs? Why why is it aerodogs? So you wanted me to pop it Croatia and give them Bosnia. Pop it Croatia. You're gonna Oh, you're gonna get a ton of territory right here. Well, Oh, well, it's not a ton of stuff you're gonna get. S oh, wait, there's a ton of m military factories right there that I would want. Still, it could be nice with just uh Actually, yeah, we're going to do it. So, Croatia. Release as puppet, release. Welcome back to the map. Sorry for annexing you. It was a honest mistake. I promise you, honest mistake. And now you also got some more territory, right? Maybe? No, 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 maybe not. Uh, okay, pop it them. This was a ton of liked, so that's why I'm doing like this one says. And then you want me to pop it Slovakia. So let's try to fix that. And we are... Oh wait, you want me to take Bosnia for you. Uh, let's see. You are NATO, you are not NATO. So we're gonna take... No, wait, you're gonna be my puppet too, yeah. Uh, 34%, we're still fine under the limit. So I'm gonna puppet you. Uh, make Italy, Bulgaria, Hungary and Romania allies. My allies. Oof, that's gonna be hard. Romania... Yeah, then I need to boost more peoples. Okay, uh, Romania... Hungary... And Bulgaria. We're boosting all of them right now. We're barely getting any political power ourselves because of it. November. Okay, then we have to wait for at least November 2008. January 2009. That's probably then when the. Well. When uh, World War will begin then. If we want all of them to be my allies when... Well, well, we'll see how long we wait actually. Or actually, we will probably not see how long we wait. It will probably be. We'll see how long, how much I can do before the NATO starts to say, hello Germany, uh, maybe you should uh, stop doing that. Here we have it, Imperium Romanum, finally, welcome. I can stop boosting popularity right there, excellent, that's awesome. Uh, let's see, create faction, uh, base reluctance, 
neither they or we are at war. Uh, we're gonna improve relationship with you just in case. Actually, we probably don't have to do it. Yeah, we probably don't have to do it. Never mind. I just threw away temporary power there. So, one ally, hopefully, quite soon. Uh, did we have any focus to get you in? Befriend Italy, right here. So we have to do this way. Well, actually, I want to challenge them with Britain. Uh, Imperial Romano leaves the European Union. No surprise right there. You are soon gonna join us. Oh, well, you'll probably join us once we declare war against Slovakia. Because then I'm at war and you might be more receptible to me. Let's see, all alliances. Sure, let's grab that one since it seems it might be necessary. God, <laughs> just boosting popularity in so many nations. It's cost quite a bit of political power. Uh, we have. Oh, only. Oh, here's the one tank. Assigned right here. And let's just move you a tiny bit. Like, more to the west side so I don't accidentally select you all the time when I want to just grab the new tanks. Uh, resource slot available. Uh, let's continue. No, no, no. Let's get the anti air one upgrade then. Uh, new motorized. Thank you. I very much like that. Defensive. No. Yes, no. Yes, yes, yes. Let's grab that. Let's grab both of them. Uh, outdated equipment in production. Let's fix the new one, please. Uh, come on. We need. Oh, right, right, right. Since we're boosting a ton of more nations, it takes longer for us. So I'm just gonna stop a tiny bit with this. I I, I just want to get the trade law first. It's right now quite a bit of penalty. Just get the trade law, and then we can once again just start boosting everyone again. Come on, shop shop. Thank you. In at least twenty, well, twenty more days, and then we can do it. Uh, boost, build there, build there, and sure, let's build in my ally. There's tons of civilian factories, uh, military factories, to try to make them as good as possible. What the hell? We, we have the flag right here. Stop having arrow dog. Stop having arrow dog. <laughs> this looks kind of hilarious. <laughs> Weird that it's arrow dog right there. I, I am playing the right version. Yeah, I'm playing Hearts of Iron, no special branch or... This is so weird. <laughs> Pretty cool, but yeah, weird. Let's see, free military factories, yes. Are we missing anything? Only tanks and mechanized so far. Uh, mechanized, do we have a full one? Yes, we do. So, all right, we need to fix this one to five if we're gonna increase the amount of normal infantry we're gonna have. Uh, let's grab that one. Let's now begin with our next tank upgrade. And then after that, I want half a full mechanized. Cool. And there we go. Let's go to limited exports. We currently have 13 trade partners and we're losing to 11. Oh, it's so only minus two. That's excellent. That's really good. Uh, boost all of you guys once again. So 0 0.5. Not as much as I would like to, but if we're going to follow that, let's just mark that one as a like. So I notice that one and that one too. Cool. So, following YouTube comments right when you're recording it. Perfect timing. There's no better timing than you can, well, talk about when you think about your pro process. Something, something. Makes sense. So, cool. You're getting here, you're getting there. How many more days before we invade you? Another 65 days. Yeah, that was 65. Building up our military industry quite quickly, actually. I like it. And let's see, we're trading with for too, too much chromium right now. Excellent. And we're still missing some oil. Uh, Saudi Arabia, I can trade with you. You're probably not going to be my enemy in quite a long time. But now we're getting too much. Come on, didn't I say you just take exactly what I need? I'm pretty sure I did, but did we suddenly increase it? I don't think so. So, uh, do you have any land? Oh, we actually have quite nice resources. Good. Let's see, you're gonna be a nice puppet. Uh, I realized that it might be good to have puppets and just follow this perfectly because 
just generally having them build a couple of troops now and then could be good for me. If I desperately need more troops on uh, this side or the left side or they're coming in with naval invasion, just jump in, request forces, send them there. So yeah, just some reserve forces right there. And right here we have six of them. You can stop training now, you are, you are no longer necessary. And what I... just keep you right here for now. And I can also tell you to start just, well, jump into this as soon as you're done. Uh, let's give you a commander of, um, yeah, you. Let's see, 11 tanks, ghost division, getting, oh, skill 2, finally. And we have 8% pants leader. So we got to fight a tiny bit this time. Uh, let's take my air force and just move it right here. And, well, over Slovakia. And you're gonna disappear very, very quickly. And this time we're just gonna puppet them right away. And not annex them and then release them as a puppet. Just puppet them right away, well, generates less world tension. So um, that would be kind of nice. Let's see, improve anti-air gun, better artillery. Let's grab better artillery. Uh, let's see. Oh, here, we need to grab that one. So we actually can create alliances. You don't have the create faction? Yeah, we can't even do that right now. Uh, international alliances. Okay, that's gonna be... Actually, is that gonna be in time right now? No, 10 days. Okay, okay, we, we need to wait for this one to finish before we do anything. Because otherwise, well, we might be not be able to do this. It all depends on if that base reluctance is changed, or if they're gonna get one more modified, like threat or something similar. Because if they get that, we will be able to invite them, otherwise we won't. So as soon as you are done, we're gonna try it. Well, we're gonna declare the war and then try to invite them. <sighs> so Japan, how's it going? Don't want to make a coup or anything. Maybe we're gonna switch to fascists right away. So I don't actually have to wait until this date. Ah? Huh? Ah? Huh? No. I don't think so. Uh, Bulgaria, you get sl slowly getting a fascist stack. You are very, very slowly getting something. 8%. That's very, very little. And Hungary, you are, well, basically the same. 3%. Why are you getting something so slowly? Have you have you picked any focuses that while well, pulling that down even more? Uh, no, that does not change anything. Here, ideology, ideology drift defense plus fifty percent. Ooh, that's bad. That's gonna really take time to convert you then. Tenth of November. Well, we should be safe. Yeah, another ten, another fifteen days. It will still be October when we declare the war. Cool. Da, da, da. 10 more days, come on, shop shop. We really didn't have, how can, how did half an hour already pass? That's impossible. It's 28 minutes, yeah I know, so don't make a comment about it, but what the hell? I just, be... what? I, I took two nations. Justified against a third, and that was half an hour. What the hell? That went just way, way, way too quickly. Uh, well, we need to do European politics. We need to clear this war. Let's see, how are joining me? Nope, we need to fix that. You're not threatened by anything. Well, you're not threatened by me, at least. So, we'll... Oh, wait, now. Now you are. There we go. Protective towards Germany. So, um... Uh, was it Berlin Alliance? I need to double check yeah, if it was Berlin Alliance 2.0 or if it was just Berlin Alliance. I don't want to mess up since you actually voted quite a lot for it. Huh? And they were heard, <laughs> heard me again. Let's see. Uh, yeah, Berlin Alliance. Well, you voted for it. So oh, wait, wait. Did I work? No. Ali Ans. Alliance, Berlin Alliance. Welcome to the Berlin Alliance. 
So, um, well, I hope you don't complain right now, because you voted for it. Uh, we're gonna puppet you, and turn, and done. And that was it, what you asked for that one. Uh, let's see. Puppet Slowakia. Yeah. And nothing else. Yeah, cool. So, there we have 12 visions. You are my puppet. Welcome to, welcome to, well, welcome to the Berlin Alliance. And so almost, so almost you say, too. Berlin Alliance, thank you. 12 divisions right here. And there isn't really a lot to do. An ex historical land of Poland and puppet the rest. Well, that, that, that I'm not gonna follow. Because, well, the last time I checked the goal, if I just modify and pick for pick everything once again let's see no that's the wrong one is this the right one no that's the wrong one too there we go the goal was to take all the land they had well before the allies declared and well that means all of poland that means uh, lithuania that means latvia belarus ukraine it probably means all the way like here no maybe not no not moscow that we never owned but Basically all of this, so I need to annex everything right here. Annex, 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 everything that is not, well, these nations, because they are my puppets. Well, it, otherwise I would have to change the goal of this campaign, but I'm completely fine with actually having the historical puppets right here, like Slovakia, Croatia, and then we need to give, well, Bosnia, Herzegovina to, well, to uh, Croatia. You were Croatia, right? <laughs> yeah, you were Croatia. <laughs> um, I, 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 I always get confused when they switch names. Just because they become my puppet or fascist or anything. Slovakian Empire. Well, I don't know if that's an empire. I would call it a puppet state. Let's see. Is there anyone else we can touch? It's Switzerland. But, um, well, stuff changed very much since I said... Take Switzerland. You said it was fine, but I um, want to double check with you just in case. Don't you dare take Switzerland. The tone of you very much changed. So, alright. Alright, I'm not going to touch Switzerland. Even though Germany had a plan to take them, I'm fine. They didn't have that land. Follow the, uh, follow the guideline that we said right here. The same reason I'm going to annex land from Poland. The same reason I'm going, well, not to take Switzerland. Take all the land they had. So, um, anyway guys, like I said, surprising amount, time went by way too quickly, but anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, that you like and subscribe, and that I will see you guys next time. Bye, subscribe, bye.